Good afternoon Malaysia, this is Jericho here and this is a Wait a Minute production. So today I'm gonna do a Mark II uh, Parma, no sorry, Coca uh, Tom Yum. So this is the second time I'm doing this one, so it's gonna be a bit different from last time. I don't have any surprise children, so it's not gonna be spicy because I ran out of it and I couldn't be asked to go out and buy because because my feet or oh, whatever oh, my legs are painful from yesterday's uh, trip to the waterfall Aitajun uh, Kanching or as I fondly like to call it Kanching Aitajun Kanching so this would be the one I'm eating Coca and it says no MSG so hopefully it is what it says it is so yeah but the only difference today I'm going to do is this one here I'm going to add some uh, coconut, grated coconut Not the... I'm not going to like take out the sauce I'm going to put... The, I mean the the coconut itself I'm just going to like put the whole thing in and just eat the grated coconut itself as well because that shit you can't like... Uh, you can't... you can't break it down it's uh, sarabut or it's... Uh, what you call it? sarabut in English uh, 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 roughage, ah, it's roughage, so you just pass through your ass. Definitely, it's good. It's something like vegetable, so it's good for bowel movement. So that's good shit. No pun intended. So let's see here, Pama, um, sorry, Coca, instant noodles, Tom Yum flavor. Okie dokie. So it's cooked noodles in 450 ml of boiling water for two minutes. Add seasoning, mix well, and serve. Two minutes. Hmm. Interesting. So the water is not boiling, but um, the oil is so little, so it is so fast it will be ready for frying. Definitely, just put it there and see whether it's. Uh, yep, it's it's okay. I have the what do you call it? Fucking hell, thing out there. Okay, no more singing. So uh, should I call it? Uh, it's called sakot or it's made from the term or something like that I'm not sure what the hell it is it's delicious uh, from the big fucking tree or tashikok in Pasir Binji go, do go there it's very cheap 70 cents per per piece of uh, of liu or something like this one sakot and this one one ton one ton uh, it's called liu in English I don't know why you call this in uh, English maybe a portion portion of what I'm not sure so yeah so it's very delicious. The sakot is sweet and it's sweet. I think they add sugar into it. Sakot, I mean, it's not that uh, that turnip or what. It's not turnip. Ubi something lah. Huh? That one is not supposed to be that sweet. So they put sugar and it, it tastes nice. Okay. Once in a while you you eat it, no problem. Even though the sugar is very high. Uh, the wonton here is made from the fish paste inside it and outside is the it's a dough. That they made it really really well. The fish. It's very fishy, so it's great shit. And you know that the fish is fish inside it. So hopefully the quality will keep on continuing to be good in uh, Pasir Binji. Tai Shi Kyo. Let's fry it nicely. Not too high the heat for the fry because you don't want it to, to be flash fried and it turns brown all of, all of a sudden. And that would be fucking hilarious. So let's put this, uh, even though it's not, not boiling, fuck it, i uh, put the, this uh, seasoning powder that has no MSG, hopefully. And the seasoning oil, the very hot oil. And if you have lemongrass, you have lemongrass, please add in, because I think it needs the lemongrass to make it more aromatic. So the soup of this, Wow, the, the spice is coming out, it's way, becoming vapor. The soup, uh, tom yum soup in that, uh, I don't know what you call it already, uh, the seafood steamboat that I had with my my buddies, uh, Isa uh, and also Jimmy. The soup is uh, almost like instant noodles, so this is the same shit as the one that they give in the steamboat, that halal steamboat place. In that, uh, in that digital, um, in that mall called the NSKV or something like that. Uh, is it in Kuchai Lam? I think so. So let's uh, turn it around, see whether it's dark brown or not. Whoa. Okay, it's pretty dark brown already. 
this one here. Okay. So my legs are very tired. I really enjoyed my, my time at the waterfalls, uh, especially the people that I met there. The pretty uh, looking, what's her name? Tatiana Abramovich and also uh, uh, Joyce Mark too. And I want to repeat myself again. If uh, uh, don't get me wrong, okay? Uh, Joyce Mark too is really pretty, but I said something that I shouldn't have said uh, before I met her. I did not intend for her to actually know about uh, my channel here. Uh, but in, in the end, I interviewed the Myanmar guy, and suddenly I, I had the opportunity to to talk to the guys there, uh, the one Vietnamese. I uh, know, yeah, one Vietnamese and the other two Malaysians. So uh, sorry about that if you are watching this video here. Uh, didn't want to be sexist, but never mind. So let's see here. Some put some of this in just one handful and see what happens. So put this back in the freezer. So I better turn down the fire on the clay pot there, and uh, yeah, it's time to add the wonton into the oil. Careful, yeah. This one is very fragile. You can break off the thing. So, yep. See you later in a second. I don't have any lemon grass because fucking hell, the plant did not uh, live in the balcony or in the in the, near my car park. So fuck it. it didn't, it's not. It's still living, but it's dying. That's unfortunate. So I'm uh, actually okay. Uh, back to the the Joyce Mark too. Sorry about that. Uh, all I can say is your boyfriend there is uh, one uh, one hell of a lucky guy. Okay, that's uh that's as much as I can say. So uh, it's frying there already. I think the sarcod is almost ready. It's very dark brown already. I don't, I don't want it to be too dark. If it's too dark, it will be too bitter. So I just want to still want the sweetness of it in. So it's boiling already here. So let's boil and put in this one here. Ah, it's just too bad there's no surprise children around. Or chibai burung. Or chabai burung. Or kampung cheese. So. Oh shit. Not too brown, okay? Not, not too dark brown for the wonton. That one you have to be careful with that one. But make sure it's uh, cooking the inside part, the fish part. You want it to be cooked so it won't get uh, food poisoning. But uh, there's no worries. Uh. It's been frozen. Even though it was spotted from uh, from Ipo to KL. So I turned on the fire for the fryer already. Turn it off. And uh, get back this piece here. Oh, I just wanted to say that uh, I think the coca which I'm using here, uh, Tom Yum, is not as excellent as the MSG laden uh, Parma Tom Yum with the one of the purple and silver packaging, very small, very, very just um, fun gulp to be finished already. That one, that one is, tastes much more excellent. That's why MSG is very, very important sometimes, even though it's uh, bad for health, like what the uh, Isa said. So, uh, I think I'll put in the uh, vegetables already to get them softer. And uh, two minutes it says, uh, I think it's uh, al dente already now, almost, uh, a few 30 more seconds or so. So, and uh, I think it's enough already, I'm, I'm not going to like keep boiling it, uh, I'm going to turn off the fire for this now. Just turn it off, the clay pot will keep on uh, boiling it, because it retains a lot of heat, the clay that is, similar to what you can get from copper pans. Uh, which the French love to use for their French dining experience. See, I already turned off the fire and it's still, or oh, turn off the the gas. Sorry, turn off the gas already. It's still boiling. See, the bubbles here coming out. So it's a it's a delayed action. Uh, hopefully, the choy sum, which is uh, quite big, it will keep on boiling. So um, this one here is extra for myself. I'm gonna it's put in this vermicelli or bihun has been put into water. So I'm gonna dump it in. And that's it. I don't need to like cook it at all because it does not warrant cooking at all. You want to keep the al, al dentiness of the of the bihun. You just dump it in while it's still hot, and there you can eat it already. It takes a couple of seconds only to cook the bihun. No problem there. So why did I put santan into it? Because I wanted to like emulate what I ate at the the tom yum or the what fish head fish head uh, restaurant. I don't know what's it called already. Me and Jimmy W went there. Uh, 
a few weeks ago the fish head bihun or the tom yum bihun there is i know it's a bit pricey about 10 ringgit one fucking big bowl that is a fucking big bowl okay you makan also mati lah and the, the soup the tom yum soup or the the fish head ching tong or chicken soup is to die for it's very nice i think they use uh, according to G jimmy w i thought they were using santan or just now as i put in the grated uh, okay it's enough already it's strong enough the grated uh, coconut but uh, is they use uh, milk oh they use milk and it's fucking delicious man you gotta go and try it there are so many branches of that particular uh, what fish head noodles thingy it's delicious you gotta try it so many branches one the original one i think is in kuchai lama so very very nice actually so i uh, think that's about it i just wanted to show you about this one and i want to apologize to that uh miss uh, joyce mark two very pretty lady indeed uh so uh, that's about it and this is my lunch for today it's around 1 p.m now and uh okay i'm not gonna like show my my fridge here because it is so shiny it might it might show my naked body yes i do go around naked all the time this is the picture that i'm doing now it will be completed in a couple of days just in time for my gundams coming in and hopefully i can curry some favor and getting it cheaper so see you in malaysia and bye bye